It is one of the most popular malls in the Bay Area, but now there's a heated fight over parking. KPIX 5's Kit Doe is at Valley Fair Mall in San Jose with more on the new plan that is getting some backlash. Valley Fair Mall will begin charging for parking in just 11 days. Beginning on February 8th, everybody is paying a fee, customers, and yes, employees. Here at Vietnam's restaurant, owner Viet Ngo started his business last year in the middle of the pandemic. After the Delta variant, Omicron variant, hiring struggles, supply chain issues, and inflation, mall management dropped one more bomb during an all-hands video call. This is what we're going to do. Paid parking is going to start on this date, and employees are going to have to pay for it. Um, Just like that? Yeah. Valley Fair says a substantial number of vehicles are left overnight on the property by people who work elsewhere. They also say owners ditch their cars at the mall and then head off to the airport. To ensure these scoff laws aren't taking up the 8,400 spaces, Valley Fair will be the first mall in the South Bay to charge for parking. For customers, the first two hours are free. It's a dollar for each additional hour. For employees, it's three dollars a day. A monthly pass is forty dollars. Mall management says this new controlled parking plan is as part of a broader focus on security at Valley Fair. By creating a more controlled parking environment, the hope is that the already popular center brings even more customers to support retailers allowing them to flourish. In June of last year, Valley Fair had a grand reopening to showcase a billion dollar renovation. Three months later in September, they held a job fair with more than 150 open positions. No says that parking fee won't help. And then now you're telling them like, oh, and you also have to pay $40 a month to work here. Like, uh, that doesn't make any sense to me. It doesn't make any sense to any of the people running the other stores who are already finding it hard to have enough employees to stay fully staffed up. The backlash has already begun. This worker petition demanding free parking passes has more than 400 signatures. Organizers claim the mall could make up to $51,000 a month off the employees. And if their demands are not met, workers will downvote the mall and Yelp and Google reviews, and they're brainstorming other actions. They're treating us as, like, commodities or ways that they can bring an extra revenue into their to their property. What's unfair is we are the workers who are keeping these stores open so that people can come shop here. Try to look at us as the people who are keeping this place alive. I guess I'm just asking for some respect, uh, which is what most employees are asking for. In San Jose, Kitto, KPIX 5.